Hi everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how can you use gpt underscore table function in order to analyze the multiple kind of data. So to start, let's say I need to I, I need to analyze data on, on the specification of various vehicles. So first of all, let me define some parameters, what kind of data I need. Um, let's say I need the, the company name. I need uh, the name of the vehicle. Okay. And uh, year of manufacture. Let's say, uh, what else do I need? Um, engine type. Mm, the airbags, it has airbags, um, horsepower of the vehicle, and the torque it has. Mm, what else do I need? Okay, the um, the average cost of the vehicle. Um, the kilometer per liter. Also for the American audience, it will be gallon per or miles per gallon. Okay. I also want to know um, the speed, the maximum speed. and uh, the 0 to 100 um, the 0 to 100 I mean how uh, a car can reach 200 km in 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 what in what time so this will be that and lastly I think that that that's enough so this is the data I need let me just do that. Perfect. So what will what I will do is I will first type the prompt here what I need. So let's say I need five uh, cars. Five cars. Yeah, that's it. Then you will come here. Type equal gpt underscore table then the bracket first of all let me increase the font size okay maybe I can zoom in yes um, then you have to um, specify the column where your prompt is which will be c3 After that, um, select the data, or it's uh, it's called the the headers. So this line will be my headers. Okay. After you select them, then close the bracket. This is a simplest function then type uh, then hit enter okay perfect let me uh, format the data first of all Okay, 
Uh, so this is the data I am interested in. It gave me five cars only. Uh, it's Toyota Camry 2021 model. It has 10 airbags and it costs around 25,000. The interesting thing is um, it can cover around 16.8 kilometer in one liter. Similarly, in case of gallons, is 39.6. Um, let me format this these values. Uh, also, it also gave me the maximum speed for a vehicle. So, let's say I want something um, five vehicles. Um, uh, whose average cost is below ten thousand dollars. Okay, just hit enter. Okay, as you can see that, um, okay, it gave me uh, five vehicles uh, whose price, the average cost is uh, below $10,000. Let me just uh, highlight these values. So similarly, if I need uh, five uh, uh, let's say I need uh, this time this uh, mm, the vehicle with the least uh, 0 to 100 time okay 5 cars with least 0 to 100 time let's see as you can see that uh, it gave me 5 vehicles and the one is the Bugatti or a Porsche or a Remac, you can see the respective times uh, a car can reach from 0 to 100 km, uh, can reach uh, 100 km speed in X amount of seconds. So the least one is the Remac, uh, it is around 1.85 seconds, uh, for a Bugatti is 2.4 seconds. The one, uh, the interesting thing is that it can cover only 5.95 kilometer per liter which is uh, pretty expensive or similarly the maximum speed is uh, 261 miles per uh, per hour you can also get the speed for in in kilometer if you specify the column here so as uh, uh, you can get the average cost and the engine type the airbags it has the horsepower and the year of manufacture so this is how you get uh, whatever kind of data you need let's uh, do one more example I need five cars with uh, uh, with with highest with highest uh, with highest kilometer per kilometer per liter so if I hit enter and wait for the response of the chat GPT perfect you can see that uh, the Toyota Prius this model has the highest uh, yes, it has the highest uh, uh, distance coverage per liter, which is 26.1 kilometer per liter. And for uh, from this list, the Lexus has around 20.4. So this is how you can get any kind of data you need. So yeah, that's it for this video. But one more thing, if you are wondering, how do I know, like, what do I have to type here? Like I type here, GPT underscore table, what... Uh, what kind of data do I need to uh, input in these in these brackets? So I will link uh, the documentation for this function in the description below uh, You can see that uh, This is the GPT underscore table. Uh, it requires a prompt and you can see the parameters here The prompt cannot be input. You have to provide a prompt then you have to provide a head uh, It is optional. Okay, so as I in my case I provided these were the my headers um, 
uh, similarly the input it can be optional it's not necessary the temperature the temperature shows uh, tells the GPT to uh, how much uh, it has to be creative the values range from 0 to 1 uh, to is used to control the creativity and then maximum token and normal etc um, one more thing you have to keep an eye uh, on your daily usage of uh, API uh, I have uh, $18 in grant which will expire on April 1 uh, and I have used around point to let me refresh it because I have used it more than the displayed amount okay so today I use around 0 0.05 dollar so yeah you have to keep an eye on your usage so that's it for this video and if you like this video then please hit the like button so this video can reach to other people so yeah I will see you in the next one